I don't know what is going on, man. All right, guys. So I'm back. I'm trying to do this. I got to do this all over again. I couldn't see nobody's comments. Comments will appear here. Okay. I want to get the comments to come through, man. I I don't I didn't know if I was if people can hear me or not. And then after I hopped off, I started. Okay. There we go. Jeez. What's up, man? All right, guys. So I gotta start this all over because this is gonna be left in in the uh, in the group. All right. What's going on, Nicole? Dante. I can see y'all now. I can see y'all now. So. Once again, my name is Guy Coates, guys. Um, I'm going to be going through this PS3 system. I'm going to try to go through it really, really quick. But I want you guys to understand what the PS3 system is and how it can help you in your business. This is something that has helped me build large organizations. It do I don't deviate from it. I don't add extra to it. There's nothing else to add. What's going on, Neil? I appreciate you, Neil. Thank you. Thank you, brother. Um, there is no extra. Uh, it's just this. PS3. That is it. That's all I use. And it's so duplicatable if you use it. You don't need anything more, anything less. Okay? What is the PS3 system? It stands for P. That stands for peak. Uh, the uh, S stands for share. The three stands for three-way call. Okay? So it's not an actual gaming system. PS3, peak, share, three-way call. Peak, share, three-way call. Peak, share, three-way call. The faster you do it, the quicker you get business partners on your team. That is it. It's that simple. Okay? When you peak somebody's interest, all you're trying to do is get them, you know, curious about what it is that you have to say. Get them curious. Hey, are you trying to make some extra money? Hey, are you sitting at home right now and you're trying to figure out what you're going to do? I mean, I know it's crazy out here. You know, what are you doing to make some extra income right now? Hey, do you are you looking for up, uh, other ways to make some income? Are you looking? Are you, are you open to making some extra income? Um, are you trying to get your bills paid for the rest of this year? Uh, are, are, is there a way that you know if I could show you a way that you can get your bills paid for the rest of this year, would you be interested? Like there's so many different questions you can ask a person to pique their interest and not share all of the information, but to make them want more information. That is what this is all about. If you guys are getting me right now, if it's making sense, anytime this is making sense, I want you to hit the heart button. OK, if it's making sense, just just double tap the heart. All right. All right. So uh, once you pique a person's interest, get them interested in what it is that you have to offer. I don't care if it was a person that was on your page that said info. If you had posted in a, a, a group and you know somebody replied info, you still hit them up in the inbox, get in the voice notes. Voice notes. Somebody write voice notes in the comments. Voice notes. They work better. Not only that, it gets you, it, it builds your courage up. First of all, a person thinks that you're going to come at them like everybody else, right? Texting. Texting, can't, they can't hear your passion. They don't know how excited you are. They don't know if you're really serious about this. But if you do voice notes, they can hear you, right? And it's going to shock them that they, and then they're going to talk back to you. This is how you start building rapport. But when you get them, after they say info, you get them in the inbox, right? And you hit them and it's like, I see that you wanted some info. I'm about to send you a nine minute video, 10 minute video, 13 minute video, however long the video is. I'm about to send you a 13 minute video. Watch it. I'm going to hit you back in, in 15 minutes and I'm going to show you how simple this really is. All right. That is it. Right. You always want to add something extra to the end of it. Now, that's just the script right there. All right. I see you wanted info or Hey, look, I'm going to send you a video right now. I want you to watch it. I'm going to hit you back in 15 minutes. All right. I'm going to show you how simple this really is. I got to I got more calls to make. I'm going to hit you back in 15 minutes. Click. That's it. What's that's what that's going to do when you say I have more calls to make. That's going to make them not ask you questions. It's going to show them that you're busy. If that makes sense, give me some hearts. Give me some hearts if it's making sense, guys. When it's when it's making sense, give me some hearts. OK. It's not that, you know, um, I want the hearts. It's the it's the simple fact that I know that this is making sense to you guys. All right. Because I can't read minds. I cannot read minds. I just want to know that it's going in. So that's why I ask for the hearts. All right. Get used to it. Get used to it. All right. So 
after you pique their interest, hey, you're looking for some extra ways to make some money, um, or you're looking for a way to make some extra income while we're sitting at home, whatever the case may be, they say yes, you know, you hit them up and say, listen, I'm about to send you a video right now. After you finish watching this video, I'm going to hit you back in 15 minutes, and I'm going to show you how easy this is, okay? I got to go. I got other calls to make. Click. Boom. Send them the video on to the next person. Are you doing is collecting decisions? It's either a yes or no. It's not rocket science and it's not hard. Once you understand that you are literally going through numbers, not everybody you talk to is going to say no. And not everybody you talk to is going to say yes, okay? The no's will build you. The yeses will build your business. Somebody write that in the comments. No's will build you. Yeses will build your business. Now, the no's doesn't mean that they're telling you no. You have to detach yourself emotionally from the outcome of the answer. OK, so if they tell you no, they're not telling you no, they're telling the business no, not you. So don't internalize the feeling of the pain that comes behind a rejection. You don't internalize that. OK, they're, they're saying no to the business opportunity right now because individuals that watch you when they when you introduce this to them, they're going to watch you. If they say no, they're going to want to see because some people are visionaries. If they are visionaries, they're going to get involved. If they're bit, they can see it. OK, when they say yes, they watch the video visionaries, they see it. They understand that if they say no, it's just not their time. Everybody get that. If they say no, it's just not right now. But they are going to watch you. Trust me, they're going to watch. OK, you already sold the seed. All you have to do is continue to build your business as you continue to build your business. That's how you water the seed by continuing to build the business. OK. Now, the next thing, the S share. OK, what are you sharing? You're sharing a video. Or you're sharing the opportunity uh, web jam, okay, that we do at 9 o'clock. What's going on, Natasha? You share the web jam at 9 o'clock, okay? The reason why the web jams work so much, we're all on there, okay? We are all on the web jam at one time, okay? Not only that, but you guys have access to the comment box on the web jam. That is your opportunity to blow it up. That is your opportunity to get your voice heard for your guest that's on there to see you typing in the comments, talking to them about, I told you, um, uh, it's so exciting. Did you hear that? Like, you guys got to blow that chat box up. Blow the chat box up when they're watching the Zoom live. And the reason why the Zoom live works better than the video is because it's live. They get to see a real person delivering the information. They see a bunch of people in the comments going crazy, right? And they can't deny that it's really real. That's why it works. The video, when you send the video out, I want you to keep this in mind, okay? The videos work, okay? They work for visionary, not for everybody. But I want you guys to understand and keep this in mind. When people go on YouTube to watch a video, what's going to happen is they're going to look at other videos. They're not going to tell you that. They're going to look at other videos. So what you want to do in our best bet is to get people on the Zoom. The Zoom is going to get them paid. The Zoom is going to get you paid, okay? So we control that room. That Zoom, that's us. That's the team. That's the family. We control that. We control what happens in the comments. We control it. We control that. We control the energy. Does that make sense? So if we wanted to be upbeat and, you know, um, personable and, you know, everybody's excited. Boom. Then y'all in the chat going crazy. Why sit back and just listen? Why sit back and just watch somebody delivering the information for you? This is for you and your guests. This is for you and your guests. I want you guys to get excited in the chat. Talk in the chat. Like, did you hear that? Oh, my God, I missed that last time. I'm so excited. I can't wait to retire my moms. I can't. Uh, Y'all in the chat going crazy. And your guests are watching it. They're looking. What's going on, Mark? How you feeling? They're watching it in the chat. They want to win, too. If they see a chat box full of individuals that are winning and you guys are winning, that's so crazy. If you're winning, why not let everybody know that you are winning, right? So you you share the information. So P stands for peak. Somebody write that in the comments. The P stands for what? What does the P stands for in the PS3 system? The P stands for peaking someone's interest. All right, peaking someone's interest, making them raise an eyebrow, getting them interested. The S stands for share. Share the information. Now, let me tell you guys 
all together. Once this thing comes full circle, I'm going to tell you why it works so well. Okay. I'm going to tell you why it works so well. So boom, peak their interest. Boom. Share the information. The next thing is the three-way call. Now I'm going to tell you what the three-way call actually does. The three-way call closes the individual for you. So when you call them back, Hey, did you watch the video? Yeah, I watched the video, but I got some questions. Look, hold all your questions. I told you I was going to I was going to show you how simple this really is. I'm about to show you how easy this is. Hold on real quick. Click over, call your upline. Call your upline. Get your upline on the phone. Look, I got my friend uh Mark on the other line. He's excited. He has some questions. This is somebody that I met off of Facebook, you know, woo, woo, whatever the case may be, you got to tell your upline. Just just let your upline know that you have somebody on this other side that you're about to merge them into. Now, when you click the upline in with your guests, okay, on a three-way call, please edification. You have to edify. When you edify, it it it, it gives the person that is on the call listening to your upline, it makes them respect your upline. Does that make sense, guys? So I can say, hey, Mark, this is my homeboy guy. You know, um, he's going to explain the business to you. All right, cool. Right. And, and you're just listening to the uh, conversation. But because you told him that this is your homeboy. It's really not no respect there. I mean, at the end of the day, he's already looking at you like, why are you doing this pyramid stuff? Right. Uh, they already think it's a pyramid. Right. So you want to edify the person that you put them on the phone with. Why? Because that person is about to close the deal for you. All right. So you make them walk on water and glow in the dark. How do you do that? It's called edification. OK. So, Mark, listen, I'm so blessed and happy enough to be able to get Mr. Coates on the line. Mr. or Mrs. Last name. Mr. or Mrs. Last name. Not my homeboy, not my homegirl, not um. The individual, no, Mr. or Mrs. Last name, respect. Y'all get that? Give me some hearts if you get it. If you get it, give me some hearts. All right, I got Mr. Coates on the phone right now. He only has a little bit of time, but he's on here to answer all your questions. He definitely can because he's an urchin. Now, you're not saying urchin. I want you guys to write this in the comments, okay? This is for the people that's going to watch this later on. An urchin is somebody who knows all the information, okay? A shark is a person that loves making money. Very, very energized at making money. Very, very ambitious. Uh, a whale is a person that likes helping people, okay? A whale is a person that likes helping people, wants to save the earth, always wants... That's the whale. And then, uh, uh, you know, uh, the dolphin. The dolphin is the person that likes to have fun, okay? Those are four personality traits, when you are dealing with individuals, they have one of those four personality traits. They have one of them, one of four. Some have two. OK, so look, I got Mr. Coates on the line. He's the type of person that loves to help people. Well, he's a ton of fun to work with. Dolphin. He makes a ton of money. Shark. And he knows all of the information. Urchin. Now, if the person that I'm putting them on the phone with is a whale and they just like having I mean just like helping people all they heard me say is Mr. Coates likes helping people it clicks now they 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 respect Mr. Coates even more why because he likes to do the same things that I like people like people that are like them okay you got me all right so if they heard me say hey look Mr. Coates makes a ton of money. You know, he likes helping people. He has a ton of fun and he knows all of the information. If they're the type of person that likes to make money, all they heard was Mr. Coates likes to make money and he makes a lot of it. Now, this is for not just for me, but when you put your upline on the phone with anybody, it almost seals the deal when you edify that. That's like 50 percent of the phone call. Then you want to add this little sauce on the top. If it's a male, ladies and gentlemen, if you're introducing them to a male your upline is a male, then you say he's the Michael Jordan of the company. Somebody write that in the comments. He's the Michael Jordan of the company. Just imagine you getting a guest on the phone with Michael Jordan. And Michael Jordan say, yeah, you need to do this. Michael Jordan is getting in. I mean, not Michael Jordan, but they're getting in because it's Michael Jordan. If it's a woman, then you say she's the Oprah Winfrey of the company. She's like the Oprah Winfrey of the company. So when you put your guests on the phone with the Oprah Winfrey of the company, I'm all ears. I want to hear it. 
I want to hear what she got to say. I know she can answer my questions. I know he can answer my questions. Boom. Three-way call gets done. Now, what I want you guys to do once you get them on the phone with each other is mute your line. Mute your line. I understand you probably know the individual that you just got them on a three-way call with your upline. I understand you probably know them, but you still want to mute your line. And you don't want to interrupt the conversation. Don't interrupt. Because when you interrupt, you de-edify your upline. Yeah, Mr. Coates, I need you to... Don't forget the... Yeah, you forgot you left out a... No. They are looking at Mr. Coates like he's helping you. So this is what I'm going to bring this all full circle. OK, not only are you listening to the questions that people have on a regular basis, you're listening to the questions, but you're also hearing the answers you're hearing, listening and you're hearing and listening. You're not saying anything. Is not that easy? Ladies and gentlemen, if it's easy, give me a number three in the comments. That is easy. It's easy. OK, now what's going to happen is. The upline is going to close out your prospect. Boom, you have a new business partner. Or they're going to have to wait. We're going to get them in the free group. It's a free group for all prospects that want to think about it, getting their money together. If you don't know what a free group is, just ask. We will give you that free group to add your uh, prospects to. Okay. And if they don't have questions and they're ready to get in, sign them up. Boom, you just got a new business partner. Now, let me tell you what happened. Okay. I'm going to tell you what happened. Every new person can do this. Every seasoned person can do this. I'm going to tell you what happens. It's a circle. Okay. First, you sent them the info. I mean, you asked them the question, the peak. You, sh you ask them a question. Are you interested in making some extra income? They say yes. You do not explain the information. The video or the presentation does. Okay. So that takes you out of thinking that you have to present. You don't. The video or the presentation did the pre presentation, right? Boom. That's one thing. Two is questions. Most people don't have the answers to the questions. So not only did you get yourself out of the way of presentation, you also got yourself out of the way of asking questions. So literally all you said out of your mouth is, is you trying to make some money? Hey, watch this video. You done watching the video? Watch. I'm about to show you how easy this is. This is Mr. Coates. He makes a ton of money. He loves helping people. He, he's a ton of fun to work with, you know, and he, and, and, and he knows all of the information. Mr. Coast, this is my friend. That's it. You don't have to know the whole business. You don't have to answer any questions. That is literally it. You didn't do nothing. All you did was lead somebody to where, where they can sign up. Where can I sign up? It was somebody on the Zoom last night that was asking, okay, what's the next step? What's the next step? Thanks, Nicole, for it. That's the name of the group, the free group, Forex Cash and Fun, guys. Forex Cash and Fun, that is the free group if you don't know, okay? Forex Cash and Fun, okay? Anybody have any questions about the PS3 system? It works, especially if you do it effectively. Now, the more you do it, the better you're going to get. I want everybody to understand you are going to suck at this at first you have to know that it's okay for you to suck at first I sucked at first until I finally started to listen to what my mentors were telling me I tried to do the business my own way for so long it was a year I sat on my business for a year trying to do it my way not this business but my first time in the industry I sat on my business for an entire year guys an entire year and I said it didn't work I said it did not work until I finally did exactly what they told me. And then all of a sudden it started working. And then I just kept doing it faster. Then you get better and better and better. You're going to get better. You start off poor. Then you get good. Then you get great. Then you become phenomenal. Okay. You have to understand that this, what we're doing, we already won. Okay. Somebody's journey is different from your journey. OK, so what that means is you still have a journey to complete. You still have a finish line to reach. It's going to happen and it's going to happen in your due season. Everything that you're going through right now is preparing you to be able to handle it when you get there. You don't want it right now. Some of you. Listen, 
Some of us can't handle an organization full of 5,000 people doing what your team is doing to you right now. Some of us cannot handle 5,000 people that ain't organized. You can't handle 5,000 people that have complaints. You can't handle 5,000. You cannot handle that on your own if you don't have other leadership right there with you. And all of that is going to take place as you grow in the business. It's all going to grow into that. So I, I told you guys out my first month in the business, I kind of sat back. I didn't do anything, um, you know, because, you know, I, I, my own personal reasons. And then I told you guys that this month I'm going in. I'm going to put and orchestrate and put things in place for us not to be all over the place. Everything is going to be structured. Everything. You are in a great place right now. All of you are royal ones. Every single last one of you are kings and queens. That position is already yours. Why? Because you're already that. So you're going there. You're going there. Every single last one of you, if you don't quit and if you think not. If you think not. All right. So that's the PS3 system. I didn't want to go this long. I just wanted to keep it short so you guys can, you know, put your, you know, guests and tag your guests or not guests, but your new business partners to this video so they can understand how to go about doing this. Now, this is the last piece. Somebody write in the comments duplication. Duplication. That is what you want. You want to be able to duplicate yourself over and over and over again. OK, so when I say I'm duplicating myself, I'm not duplicating me like my mind. I'm duplicating a bunch of individuals that are their own leaders. Like you have to self be disciplined yourself. So we're disciplining and creating duplication in our organization. So when we do get to 5000 people in our organization, you have leaders underneath of leaders, underneath of leaders, underneath of leaders that are bringing in new people. And they're all duplicating the same thing over and over and over and over again. Do y'all understand what I'm saying? So what's easy? PS3 system or a whole bunch of other ways of trying to, you know, get people involved in it. But that's too much. It's too much. What people are going to do is they're going to do exactly what you did to get them in the business. If it was a road sign, guess what they're going to think they have to do? Get a road sign. If it was a magnet on the car, that's what they think they're going to have to do. Get a magnet on the car. If it was mass mass mailing, sending out mail, little cards in the mail, then they're going to think they have to do the same thing. Put a bunch of little cards in the mail. No. Peak their interest. Are you looking for other ways to make income out, outside of what you currently are doing? Hey, I need your opinion on something. If it's somebody that you look up to. OK, somebody very intelligent, somebody that you look up to, somebody that you consider a mentor, always ask them this. Don't ask them if they looking for other ways to make money because they already make money. Ask them, listen, I need I need your opinion on something. I need you to take a look at something for me. Can you do that for me? Look, I value your opinion. OK, I need you to take a look at something for me. Right. And you let them take a look at it. And look, before they even try to hit you with a bunch of questions, you still hit them with the system. What is the system? Hey, look, I know you like what you saw. You probably have questions. I know you got some things to say, but I have a treat for you. I was uh I was blessed enough to be able to get Mr. Coates on the line. When I think of you, I think of him. When I think of him, I think of you. Both of you guys are equally successful. He loves making money. He loves helping people. You know, this is the person that can answer all your questions. So without further ado, this is Mr. Coates. Mr. Coates, this is one of my mentors. I thought you guys should get on the call. Mute it. Then let them go back and forth. Okay? Let them go back and forth. I don't want you to feel overwhelmed. Overwhelmed people do nothing. If you're a person in this business right now and you're thinking, I can't get anybody. Why are you, why are you telling yourself that? Everything that you say out your mouth, it comes, comes to fruition. You're literally saying it and you're feeling it, which means you draw it. You, you're attracting it, which is why affirmations are so important. To get up and say, I'm going to attract the leader in my business today. I'm so thankful and happy now that I'm attracting leaders into my business. People that know how to build business that will not quit. I'm attracting that into my business today. You cannot say that if you feel, okay, if you feel like it's not working. 
Okay? If you feel like you talk to everybody and you only talk to three, and three is not everybody. Okay? So we have to get better at becoming better versions of ourselves. It's a mental thing. It's a mental mind shift that will happen to each and every one of you guys. Every single last one of you guys will understand that it's not my team. It's not them. It's me. It's me. It's always been me. I have an opportunity to go to five, uh, uh, 10,000, 20,000, whatever it is that you're looking for in this business. I have the opportunity to make that happen. Right. I have that opportunity and I can give that same opportunity to others. I can give it the same opportunity to others. So who is it left up to, though? You. It's literally left up to you. The sooner you start looking and pointing at your people that's not doing anything in your bed, if they're not doing anything, the sooner you start doing that, you have fell out of phase one and you have landed yourself in phase two. Phase two is a no, no. None of us want to go to phase two. Phase two is what? Managing your team. Don't go there. That's that's for when you get to a whole nother level. Don't step into that level. When you're new, don't start mad. If you get a couple people on your team, if you're a knight, if you're a knight and a noble and you don't have multiple knights and nobles underneath of you right now, do not try to run a team. Continue to do the same thing over and over again. Continue. because so, so if you are a knight, a noble, if you continue to do the things that you did to get you there, you're going to continue to move up in rank. Not only that, you're going to help your team uh, move up in rank as well. Right. And then they're going to follow exactly what you're doing. Everybody follows the person that got them involved. I don't I don't. Look, this is a human trait. This is what people do. We duplicate. <laughs> we duplicate. This is what we do. So if you start pointing fingers at people on your team that's not doing any. Look, if you start doing that, they're going to start doing that. Do not stop what got you to where you are. OK, always stay in phase one. Phase one gets it done. That's what my mentor told me. Phase one gets it done. What is phase one? Constantly sharing the information with others that will get you recruits. Phase one gets it done. This is network marketing, guys, at its finest, okay? And when you are involved in network marketing, it's all about relationship building. They really call it relationship marketing, honestly, because it's all about building relationships. So, um, you know, I want to start getting out and pounding out this, this mindset, you know, getting out these skill sets, getting out these tools, because PS3 is a tool. It's a tool for you to use to, you know, grow your business. OK, it's a tool for you to use to grow your business. Now, let me know if you guys enjoyed this, if it was helpful, if it was helpful, let me know. I appreciate everybody for hopping on here. All right. Y'all know that everybody that joins this group is going to see this. They're going to see this. OK, they're going to see this and you can tag them in this and they'll be able to rewatch it. OK. So let them know, you know, let them know right now that you were here. <laughs> you were here because those new people are going to come from you guys. It's going to come from you guys. Everybody that watches this, you're going to get new people, new partners joining the business. And you get to tag them in this and you get to let them know that you were here. I was I did it, too. I went through this training as well. All right. I appreciate you guys for tuning in. Thanks, everybody, for the love, the hearts on the side. Um. When it comes to our our uh, the 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 the, 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 uh, the webinars, the webinars, ladies and gentlemen, please, please, when you get on the webinar, you're going to grow. You guys are going to grow. You're going to grow into leaders. Do not be scared to speak in the comments. Do not be scared to talk about how you feel, how good you feel, where you're going, where you came from, where you're at. Another thing about this team and this group, everything that's that happens here or is talked about here stays here. This is a family. We do not let out people's information. If somebody told their story or testimony in this group, it stays in this group. Do not go out here sharing people's stuff. We will have one big, this is going to be a movement, but it's a family. 
Everybody is going to trust one another. Nobody is going to undercut anybody. Make anybody feel some type of way. There is no negativity here. We are all kings and queens. We all have our own throne to rule and sit on. With that being said, why worry about the next man's throne? Matter of fact, help that man get there. The more we help each other, the faster we win. The more people feel welcomed into our movement, the faster we win. Everybody wants to feel appreciated, loved, respected. All of us do. All of us want to feel that. We all want to feel respected. We all want to feel loved. And we all want to feel appreciated for what we do. Every single last one of us, which is why... When people get promoted, they love it. It feels great. When somebody joins, if I was to join this group right now, I want to feel loved. Like, I don't know anyone. I want to feel the love. I want to feel like, you know, wow, where, where have you guys been all my life? Let me tell you what I've been through. I didn't know that there. I felt as though there was a kingdom for me. I felt that the kingdom was out there. Now I found it. This is deeper than what you think. It's not just about money. It's actually bigger than money because you have to become first. And in order to become who you surround yourself with has a lot to do with alignment. You have to align yourself with the individuals that are taking you or, or, or pushing you or pulling you in the direction that you want to go so that you can become the king or queen that you are. In order to become that, you surround yourself with other kings and queens going the direction that you're going or already been there and they're trying to pull you forward. That is what this is. We are winning and we already won. So once you understand that, you can't be like, well, it's not working for me. When, since when? You didn't give it enough time to work for you, nor did you give your, yourself enough time to grow. To be able to handle what you're saying is not working for you. For you to even say that means your mindset isn't right and it's not ready. It's working. It just takes time for you and your journey. And that's okay. That's okay. You have it. It's in you. You will be stout. You will be stout. Okay? So it's all about your mindset and what you see, what you think, what you hear. What are you letting in your ear gates? If you're constantly listening to negative music or negative people or you have negative people around you, that is what you're going to think. How can you get out of it? You know, how can you not think that? That's all that you're letting into your ear gates. You have to protect your ear gates, ladies and gentlemen. Protect your ear gates. That's why I'm going to start uh, putting... Uh, uh, videos in the group. I call it homework. I don't want y'all to feel like y'all in school, but we're learning here. So it kind of is school. I call it Diamond University, right? Diamond University. Why? Because we are all becoming diamonds. We're in the process of becoming diamonds and we're going through a, I don't want to call it a four year course, because normally in school it's four years, but over here it just seems like, yo, I would rather it be shorter, all right? A shorter period of time, all right? So the next time somebody tells y'all y'all in a get-rich-quick scheme, look, hey, thank you. What you want, to get rich slow? I'd rather get rich slow, okay, rather than get rich never. And because you think it's a, a get rich quick scheme, thank you. I appreciate it. You can take the steam off of there, but I ain't got no problem with getting rich quick. It's better than getting rich slow, but at least we're getting rich slow and it's better than getting rich never. Diamond University, y'all. How do y'all like that? Y'all like that? Diamond University? Because it's all a process. We're going through a process and we're going through this thing together, man. No man left behind. I love you guys. All right, you may not all now disconnect. I hope this was helpful. Um, make sure that you tag new people to this. It's very, very long. I'm going to probably do another PS3 uh, PS3 training that's going to just talk about the PS3, and it's going to be very, very quick. It seems like every time I talk, I always go into, like, <sighs> like really just pouring out. I always go into pouring out. You understand? I don't... It's, it's like you really love people enough not to leave them where they are if that makes sense you don't want them to stay there like why aren't you where you want to be why aren't you there yet how come 
And if you blame it on somebody else, you still didn't learn yet. You don't know yet. If you blame it on someone else besides yourself, it seems like we will point the finger at everybody else except for ourselves and ourselves and the decisions that we made led us up to this point, not no one else. So now we have to change our decisions, change our mindset, because that same old broke mindset has us where we are, where we want to go. We have to develop and that's OK. And you can do it. All right. I love you guys. That is the end of this piece of deuces. I'm glad y'all came in here. I appreciate y'all, man. This is our team. Y'all the royalty. That is us. Diamond University. That is us. This is us. You all are royal ones. That is y'all. That is me. We are we. My team is your team. It's all one. If you if you if you feel that, and when you understand that, that's when we go up. That's when we go up. You cannot point fingers. It's up to you. But guess what? There are a bunch of people are surrounding you that it's up to them too. We are all one and we're all going for it we are all going for it don't point no fingers don't get mad at nobody else it's a negative energy negative vibes are down here and when you vibrate at a low frequency you get low frequency stuff all right we going up we got a vibe at that frequency we going up all right y'all that's it love y'all let's go Thank God it's Monday. It's like, nah, let me stop. Y'all see my man at the bottom, man. All right, y'all. I'll talk to you guys later, man.